featured this perfume in my last collection as you can tell this is Marc Jacobs the can dance this perfume this is hey I will, yeah hey see me yeah hey I have arrived this is the perfume hey look at me you're looking for me you're looking for somebody and you know that this is the perfume the person wears this is the perfume this is the smell you should be looking for not this because this smell is going to take you oh god i can't act why well, i can't explain but this is this is strong this this perfume is an attention seeker you wear it and i'm like ah i'm here feel me now latest latest let me show you this this is the perfume every girl should have yes i said it with my full chest c by giorgio giorgio amani is a perfume every 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 girl should have if you can afford it please plug into c is it c or side i think it's c actually i've tried the red one before but this is <laughs> i love 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 it's new i haven't used much of it i think i've only used like three times but i think it is Three weeks old yeah yeah so uh, i forgot to mention this doll say and gabbana was an unboxed perfume so i stumbled on the page that sells unboxed perfume it said it's original but it looks original it has everything original perfumes have except for the box so let me plug you guys into what i know that if you're a perfume lover you would have seen that there are a lot of pages now selling something called unboxed perfumes yeah and sometimes you see ridiculous prices I'm, i bet you when you see a perfume that somebody selling unboxed most likely check the original check the price difference for real unboxed perfume price difference between the um boxed one and unboxed is usually not much so you have to check the original price before making a decision to buy if if it's too ridiculous i mean just know that you're buying fake then again no that cannot be 100 percent trusted but let me just let you know what they call unboxed perfume so if you're a perfume retailer from most likely wholesaler most likely directly from the company or from their major distributors when you're buying like a range of products from the, you so if a perfume seller is buying i don't know how many but if the person is buying c from Giorgio armani or from their wholesaler or their distributor they are going to get testers so testers are what when you go into an essence is it essence yeah i think that's yes essence that they sell perfumes the sephora to buy a perfume you would most likely and most definitely see testers on the first front row of the shelf those are the samples that the companies give to perfume sellers to for their customers to test before they buy so that's what people have started selling as unboxed perfumes so my problem is i don't know how unboxed perfumes now became a very rampant thing because testers have been from the time of ages from the ages age ages past i used to buy testers as a student because i could not afford it it's not as if the price difference was so much but because it was free the sellers don't pay for it so they sell it at a more reduced price than the original than the packaged perfume yeah, so that's what people now sell as testers as unboxed i used to block myself to it since since i've been back in the days anyways let me move you to my newest baby so like i said i i i unconsciously thought that whenever i'm doing a perfume collection video i will unbox my latest perfume so i'm going to do it around when i'm getting a new perfume here yeah? so this baby is what influenced this video i never i didn't think that i was going to do this video i think it was around this time i did it last year yeah it was around the time i did it last year can you believe that it was october or september i did it last year anyways it was september yes i remember so um 
so my birthday was two weeks ago yeah you can wish me happy birthday i know i know so a friend of mine kindly found it nice to give me a perfume so let me tell you the story behind it long story but let me just shorten it so i posted when i posted that review that i was talking about the reel of my perfume collection the monday tuesday I wrote in the comment section that in the caption on my Instagram. So if you are not following me on Instagram, go girl, go plug yourself. I'll leave my Instagram handle is somewhere plain. So I put in the caption that if you want to buy me a gift and you don't know what to gift in, just buy me a perfume. So that friend of mine saw that post and thought, let me gift that me a perfume for her birthday. So I received this perfume two days ago. I could so in, i didn't have it in my subconscious that oh you have a new perfume now do a collection no so when i got the perfume i didn't open it that day because it was anonymous so i waited the next day until i found the sender before i opened it so as that when i opened it i didn't know i was doing this video yet so i already opened the perfume but i just thought come and show you the to still give you the feel of unboxing a new perfume so i'm going to show you the box and the light on the perfume fortunately i didn't trash it because when i opened it i just returned it back into the box so now i'm about to trash it so this is the light <laughs> this is the light on. this is the perfume the value of the perfume are you guys ready to see my newest baby i'm showing you the back of me i know i know that some of you already know this perfume but let me just show you This is the perfume Libre by YSL. It's a floral perfume. I love, 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 love this bottle. So let me give you backstory. It's going to be a long story, but let me just shorten it. So a friend of mine sells perfume. She reached out to me some days ago and asked that what are my latest obsession with perfumes because she knows I love perfumes here. Yeah? What are my latest obsession with perfume? She told her, she said, what would you like to get? What would you want at the moment? And I'm like, I want this YSL Fibre. Whatever, I want this YSL. I showed her, oh, of course, she's a perfume seller, so she knows it. I'm like, ah, that's a nice perfume. Um, I told her that, oh, this is perfume. I'm like, oh, nice suggestion, nice wanting, blah, blah, blah. And then some days after, I get a call that I have a delivery and it turns out to be this perfume and I sent her a message Hello babe, you sent me a perfume from where out She said it's anonymous I'm like, you're going to tell me who this anonymous is And long story short, she told me that it was that friend of mine that told her to ask me which perfume I want at the moment So, I'm going to leave the name of my friend that sells original perfumes right on the page right now i can't remember a uh, page off it but i'm going to leave it on the screen please patronize her i know that we're a small community but please and thank you to my friend that got me this perfume god will bless you god will enrich you god will provide for you your money will not finish in jesus name so that you can have more money to buy me more perfumes i prophesied it to your life more perfumes more perfumes <laughs> okay yeah i have a ysl I haven't used this perfume let me not lie i have not used this so why didn't it come full anyways the floral perfume i love the bottle i love the black and gold detailing i love that the perfume inside is um what they call this thing it's not gold gold i don't know but i love this perfume in advance to start using it Anyways, there's a big elephant in the room. I almost missed. I'm like, okay, I just did this a quick scan on my table and I'm like, where is this perfume? Do you guys want to see it? This is very rude of me. It should have been the okay. This is the last so I'm sorry why I say but <laughs> this is another perfume every girl should have. Like, have it if you can afford it. Also, the money I buy this perfume. 
<laughs> Lancome Esther Ville Belle or something. La Ville Est Belle. Belle. This perfume, this perfume, this is Lancome, this is Lancome, this is it. This is a very attention seeking perfume. Attention seeking, I don't know how to describe, but this is a perfume that will last long. Long, this is the definition of long lasting perfume. Believe me when I say it. Also, the money. <laughs> Buy this perfume if you can. It's beautiful. So, what do I want to tell you about perfumes again is that you see this, this, I can't tell of why I sell yet, but this and the C, Psy, they are attention seekers. You wear them, and somebody will know that you are wearing something. You get me? Are you there? yeah that is all about so let me tell you two perfumes that i want right now maybe like not now 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 but the perfumes i want next so it is scandal and good girl i don't know where they're from but scandal and good girl i want those two perfumes because i've seen a lot of rave about them so there's a lot of rave, rave about this ysl to a lot of rave about this lancome lancome has been in existence for I think about three years now or four years c2 has, has been in existence for about three years but this ysl is new um this black opium this five fiber a bit fibre is new black opium has been in existence the only one has been in existence for a short period the candy has been in existence for a long while this mark jacobs daisy dream has been in existence for a long while i think those are the Unquote, I think those are the quote and unquote luxury perfumes that I have. The rest are affordable perfumes that I can easily spend money on. <laughs> so I want to show you something. It's not mine. It's for a, it's for a friend of mine. She ordered it and he somehow got into my hands because she wasn't available to receive it. Are you guys ready to see one of the perfumes that I said I want? Skanda, 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 skanda. It's not mine, but this is what it looks like. This is what the bottle looks like. Like a scandalous girl over down, I mean, upside down. So this is what the perfume looks like. I wish I could open it, smell it, but it's not mine, and I cannot say story. So, yeah. By John Paul, I didn't know that. Anyways, I don't need to know the maker, I just know the name and I know the bottle. So that's scandal. I want scandal. Buy me scandal. If God laying it in your heart, if your spirit is laying it in your heart to buy me scandal, um, it's not too late to buy me birthday gift. I see in October, even November, December, January, February, till my next birthday, I'm still available for birthday gift. So, yep, yep. anyways, this is this, that is that on that. For my perfume collections i hope you enjoyed this video as much as i did i'm sorry if i couldn't explain express give you the major in depth to each scent i'm sorry please forgive me i'm not good with explaining scents that do not have explanation you get but anyways i hope you enjoyed this video